Hi, I'm PJ Clark. I'm Nikki Davis, we're from Jeep Management um, and we've been producing this clip today for Women's Community Shelters. Our industry especially is so passionate to support one another in these times and what better than to put our talents yeah. and collab with the best of the best to promote something really worthwhile and something very close to our hearts. I'm Jacinta Gulasano, I'm looking after the vocal aspect of this project. Hi, my name is Pablo, I'm a makeup artist. The reasons why I chose to work with women's community shelters is because I think that every single woman deserves to feel beautiful. Um, I think she also deserves to feel safe, um, wanted and welcome. And um, being a hairstylist, that's a, such a huge part of what I do. Uh, when Jeep approached me and asked asked if I wanted to be involved, I couldn't say yes any faster. It's such an incredible cause and we were so incredibly touched that these phenomenal artists have all come together to support women and children most at need. This year, you know, statistically speaking, has also been so challenging uh, when, it, when it comes to the work that women's community shelters do. Um, and, you know, so many women and children finding themselves homeless and the work that they do is invaluable. So we knew if we were going to create this beautiful piece, we had to dedicate it to some beautiful work. You think of a shelter and you think of some crisis accommodation for one night, but we are supporting shelters that are more than that. They are rehabilitating women and children. They are helping them find new homes, new paths, new safe lives. And I think um, this, this is huge. And that's the real reason we got here today with all the sequins. <laughs> Girl power, women power, and that's why we're here today. What better way to feel powerful and beautiful than with a whole bunch of women? And I cannot stress enough that when women support women, incredible things happen. So we're really hoping that people can get behind this, to get educated, yes. to support, and to be aware. And if you are aware of your friends, your loved ones... <clears throat> I think it's an issue that's touched us all personally in the space today um, in different ways and I think if we can start conversations, um, conversations be between these people and they can grow and grow and bigger conversations can happen, that, that would be our ultimate goal. Sometimes we associate domestic abuse with older women, but this is actually an issue in young adults and teens as well. Even in my first relationship, my mother noticed some changes. We know that in Australia, one woman every week dies at the hands of her partner. And today's a day where we, in Australia, say that that's not on, that's not okay, and that we're prepared to step up and make a positive change. I think coming together with a really great, beautiful, strong bunch of women um, to raise awareness and you know, bring attention to something like this is really special and really important. Guys, we had an amazing day today. It was epic. We enjoyed it, but enough fun. If you need help and you need to reach out, what we do hope is that people watch this piece and yeah, they, they click a little further. Please reach out to your friends and make sure they are okay. We need to shine light on this really important issue to make sure that women are being respected and they feel safe. Click on the link. Even if it's five dollars, please donate, help support them. It starts with small changes and we can, I think together we can make something big happen. <laughs>